Okay, here we are in Tokyo. Can you believe it? I'm so excited. And you're not even jet lagged, darn no. you. <laughs> I'm the one tired and dragging. That's right. No, but we wanted to talk a little bit about how important documentation is to OpenStack. And I've been carrying that creed forever. So it's really wonderful to have Lana. I've recently recently taken over the helm as, as documentation PTL. Uh, so Liberty was my, my very first release, which just has gone out. And now she we're getting, getting, yeah. getting ready to plan Mataka. Yeah. And so I actually had to look up the stats, but um, our last release had 1,900 doc changes in six months by 300 people. That's a lot. That's the most we've ever had. Um, and it just keeps growing. And I, you know, I think that that shows also that the percentage of doc contributors compared to overall oversight contributors is also creeping up. Absolutely. So that matters too. I think it shows that docs is becoming more and more important to a lot of people. And while we're talking stats, we, we've also just recently found out from the survey that uh, two thirds of people see the documentation at least weekly, yeah. which is really exciting. That's awesome. So I think that shows exactly how important documentation is to people at the moment. And we're really committed to making sure it's the, the best documentation possible. And of course, documentation is, is a wide variety of things. And so the thing we saw last release was that the API docs had the most contributors overall to docs. I didn't right. do the stats for this past release, but to see that growth is also like, my, my little pet project, right, is the <laughs> API docs, so. And of course, they're really important too, as, as well as all our developer docs. Right. Uh, and that, our, our development team are, are, are brilliant at creating documentation. And of course, a lot of that flows into the official OpenStack documentation right. as well. I mean, there's a new infrastructure guide, there's a new project guide. Um, people are just taking the idea and, and running with it of a, of a doc sprint, of you know treating docs like code, let's track the bugs against the doc. It's, it's been really a cool place to innovate with documentation. Absolutely. So should we talk about how people get involved? Absolutely, because there's this awesome new thing. <laughs> so one thing we're really excited about with this release is the fact that we now have a an article in the printed super user guide, which is being distributed at, at this summit here right in Tokyo. Corner. So if you need, to, you need to turn to page 14 of your super user guide and have a look at that, because that's got, hopefully, all the, all the answers you have answered, all the questions you have answered. Yes. Uh, obviously, we're, we're also available on the mailing list and IRC and all those other places where we can answer any questions you have. Absolutely. Great. Good. Thanks, Anne. Yeah, good talking to you, Lana. <laughs>